I got proper bad nipple rub. What happened, mate? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, mate, do you know when you watch motocross riders and they can't, like, they get stuck in a hay bale? And you're like, why can't you get over that? Shout out to Dieter. Yeah. Been fortunate enough to get this 390 today for a little test ride. Back out here with this stranger. Alan. Don't know if you remember him from the uh, from the vlogs, but he's one of the original part owners. It doesn't right. seem to turn up, but he's back. And also Rev Revolution Trials. Pick these up, sort them out for a gummy for the hard enduro next week and a moose. So, see how this goes today. I can see myself spending a fortune on one of these now. But yeah, we'll see how she goes, eh? Just... Right, so, oh, fuck, forgot about that lever. There we go. So, just in one lap, just to fucking get the feelers of the bike and I. I think because the suspension's not set up for me, the first impressions weren't great. I was slipping everywhere, but it's excuses. One lap, so we'll see how we go. The uh, just started a fresh page in the old excuse book. That's how. Yeah, I mean that. Yeah, I've got plenty of them. We we nearly got out of the excuse book, but yeah, well, we'll see we might we'll be we might be back in it again now. The, uh, AORC and QORC monster. This so this is like similar shit. Let's see how we go. Eh? <laughs> Don't touch the throttle. I didn't then. It don't start as fast. The two strokes start straight away. These don't start as fast. He's a higglet's whole bike.
I think uh just slipping a lot. It's like back end no grip. What's in the tire though? Well, here rock hard. All right, try again. Done the tire now. I reckon the suspension is probably just stiff as on the back. Well, the ride is shit then. I got that hill clean that time. Oh. It's hard when you're behind you. Can't see anything, can you? I'll try to do one more like now. Oh. Felt a little bit better that time just because I know how to predict it a little bit more. What's the verdict? It's changed it completely. That. You like it? Well, is it you, you don't feel like you're reaching anymore. No. I need to go. go now. That's good. Look Great. good on it. Apart from your little stall, no, it's it's hard to get them going again. No. It's like fourth gear though. That's, yeah. Uh... But uh, you look well on it. You look planted around this corner. You didn't look like you getting out of control. Carrying good speed on it. Good. Good. It's your go now anyway, because you're buying. He reckons I'm buying, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll go for a little little lap. You reckon that's changed it? Man, have a go. Just reach for that. That is just transform that bike now. I reckon it'll be even better again. Dropping them down and sitting that. Yeah, yeah, because it don't, don't seem to be twitchy, does it? At the moment. So you probably go down without it being twitchy. Planted then. 
I've not had the front end wash or anything. It still feels good to corner for me. But yeah, I don't know. Probably worth doing it. I feel, I feel like it feels like it sits high at the back though on these. Do you think? breathe. Fucked it up for going down now, there's at least rocks everywhere. Oh. <clears throat> smooth, you don't have to go smooth. Smooth is fast in a hard enduro, mate. I'm not an hard enduro already, mate. Come on, let's get a bit of content. I'll just fall off here. Come on. Keep that foot on the peg and like lean right back and just ride with that foot on the peg. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Nearly had the thumbnail sorted. So mate, do you know when you watch motocross riders and they can't like, they get stuck in a hay bale? Hey. And you're like, why can't you get over that? You can go fast around all the fast enduro shit. Nah. Bit, bit of a log. Unless you can hit that in third gear, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have a little fast lap on the 390 on the new track. It's a little bit longer. You ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs>
bearing in mind, Dalton doesn't actually like big boars. He's, you he don't, he don't like them. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, what happened there, lad? Oh, oh my ribs are on handlebars. That was, a, that was a good one, that. I thought you were fucking dropping the bike, though. Oh. Three, two, one, go! How slow do you think? Nothing went right on that one. 
Nothing at all. Yeah. Nothing at all. Don't carry speed down here. Uh, messed up in that little corner trying to go up the hill. Did you? Uh, so what? what's your guess on time? That's a fucking 17, 18 or something. Do you reckon? And you were tired? Yeah, I really Didn't really want to do that one, did you? No. Four minutes eight. No way. Four minutes eight. You got quicker? Quicker, second quicker. Fucking on way. That does surprise me. Because <laughs> if that was a test day on that, and I got fucking 15 minutes to ride it, 10 minutes. You I'd have hated it and I never would have bought it. Bars, but yeah. being able to fucking, so thanks to Beta, by the way, for letting us actually take the bike out, trusting us. Um, it is for sale. They might have, it is actually for sale. It's actually a very good bike, it's spotless. Even though I've been riding it, it still is spotless. Um, you'll have to tell, ask them about the price because I'm not quite sure. But Beta have actually just let us use this bike. And I, if I would have done this on a test day, I'd have never have bought it ever because I hated it when I first rode it this morning. But maybe it's growing on me. We'll see what. So then, what do you think compared to the 250? Hard to say because the 250 on here today, but but I don't know. It's <laughs> I don't feel quicker, but the times say you are. I feel better in corners. Numbers don't lie, do they? The clock doesn't lie, sadly, Lewis. I have to give the boys at Clowns a little call. You might have to at this rate. <laughs>